Alright, uh, today I'm gonna give you guys a updated look on uh, this Fawn Joy Batman figure. Uh, I'm surprised I didn't even uh, think of this, but putting him on the bat pot uh, from McFarlane Toys, and he fits perfectly on there. So if you have the McFarlane Toys uh, bat pot, I mean the bat cycle, then uh, yeah, this Fawn Joy uh, Batman will fit perfectly on there. So right now I got him situated where he's kind of low down on the ground, a low down on the um, on the bat. Uh, on the bat psycho itself and then you can see his eyes are still looking forward which is nice so here you can see if I zoom in a little bit you guys can see he's looking straight at you so that is awesome I like that a lot and uh, you can see let me move the cape out of the way so you can kind of see how the body is situated and uh, it looks very natural actually and uh, if you want to raise them up a little bit you could just raise the arms up and then there we go more of a uh, regular riding pose and if he's uh, speeding trying to get those aerodynamic pose aerodynamic uh, stream out of uh, out of it then uh, you could have him low down like that and uh, it still fits perfectly and um, the gripping hands that he has this is uh, as well. These are the uh, grapnel gun hands, and uh, they fit this uh, steering wheel. I mean the uh, handlebar quite well. So yeah, uh, the legs a little weird. I mean it's uh, it's turned a little bit. You kind of see if you look at it from up front, you can see it kind of see how um, the the way the ankle is turned that way is uh, doesn't line up uh, perfectly, but still it works. And then uh, let's see here if you want him can you go one leg on the ground uh, yes he can so let's try that too so if you want him wow look at that that looks good tell me so uh, this cape is uh, oh, a wire cape so it allows him to do something like that so now he's doing a turn really nice on one leg down very cool so yeah you could definitely do that for this uh fun joy batman here man i must say this is uh if perfectly fitted onto this bike here it felt like uh, this figure was meant for this bike here so again if you have this bike congratulations and uh, definitely get the fun joy uh, batman because he will fit in here perfectly so let's get him off the bike and uh, let's take a look at him uh, next to the uh, the uh, Flash movie Affleck Batman here, okay? So here is that one next to the Fun Joy and uh, you can see the difference between the two. It's night and day. Oh my, I didn't realize how small this thing is. Look at the head size. So tiny and looks nothing like Affleck here so yeah look at that Oof, my goodness look at the proportion this one's much much better so yeah e yikes let me pop the head off I don't even think that will do any doing anything with it I don't think that will help though because um, the, the the head sculpt here is a lot darker this is a black and this is more of a gray color so even if I pop it off I don't think it'll, it'll look that good but just for the heck of it here's how he looks uh, with it on and uh, it's very loose though it is really loose look at how loose this head is mm. so yeah but uh, you kind of get an idea. I mean, eh, I guess somewhat fits. Let me put him on the bike too. So let's see here. So if I were to put this one on the bike again. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, ouch. Oh, these hands are not cooperating, but whatever. I'll just do it that way for now. Get, get, get. So, yeah, it's, it doesn't really help that much. Uh, I mean, it, it kind of, it kind of okay. 
uh, this angle right here because but if you look at it up close you will see there's a color difference between the head and the neck but uh, actually it kind of works I guess yeah like that you can see that pose right here I mean it, it looks decent I mean it's not terrible but I think the Fon Joy one uh, is a little bit better so yeah so I'm gonna probably put him back uh, onto the other Batman I put the Fon Joy Batman back on here so that one should look a lot nicer than this one here pop this thing back on pop this thing back on the cow oh my goodness that was tough so line up the cape again with the holes on the back and then now pop this thing back on so there we have on Joy Batman again. Let me have him stand next to the bike so you guys can kind of get an idea the height wise as well too. So yeah. So there he is standing next to the bike and uh, yeah it fits really well. So let me put him back on here. So just uh, Yeah it's just way way better than the McFarlane Toys one and this thing only costs like what 40 ish somewhere around there I think it's completely worth it uh, yeah because what uh, McFarlane stuff are already $30 and the sculpts aren't even that good uh, with this one sculpt is good and then the articulation is decent so I say and it's got a cloth cape and has wire running through it so I'll be gladly pay a little bit more for something this much better oops sorry so there you go there's the uh, fun joy Batman on the Micron toys uh, bat cycle and uh, thanks for watching okay one uh, one final thing is that uh, the more I look at this uh, head sculpt the more I like this uh, I, I guess I'm, I'm a little tainted by it because uh, I've seen the Muff Toys and uh, that one is absolutely gorgeous so compare that to this it's definitely a step, step down but if I've never seen the uh, Muff Toys or if I don't own the Muff Toys then this has to be the best uh, head sculpt that we have seen so far from this from uh, from from the scale or anything lower than that, I think the uh, the Mesco one is okay, but uh, overall I think this one has uh, uh, it captures him a little a bit better than uh, than the Mesco one. But other than that, yeah, this is a fantastic figure. Again, I'm just uh, beating a dead horse here, but uh, yeah, if you if you're on the fence about it, definitely go get it. Um, I got it uh, through um, what is that? Uh, Gundamit.com. G-U-N-D-A-M-I-T.com is basically a uh, I think is a sister um, site f uh, from uh, Show Z. So yeah, that's there. Uh, that's the place where I got this from. And uh, yeah, if you could, uh, if you if you have chance or if you want to, I say go for it. It's uh, totally worth getting. So hopefully there are more from this company. Um, yeah, I would love to see more uh, figures out of this company. And yeah, it looks fantastic. So there you go. Again, thanks for watching.